So many out early in the morning, and they're avoiding the rush hour through the all the roundabout. And they're but, um, but, uh, I have to apologize first of all that unfortunately we couldn't get our projectors, our slide support, or anything that working and out there. So um, uh, we, our IT and everything else, we just couldn't get it worked. So we'd have to carry on without it. And out there, um, I'd like to say that uh, you're. All here, welcome back there, especially the businesses who give us a lot of support throughout the year. And some of them are with us five, six years now, and they continually support us year in, year out. With that support, and that there, it enables us to contribute towards some of the functions that are going on here. Like we had a very major energy project over the last couple of years, and I'm glad to see uh, John McKennedy here from the community school because. Through them and out there, this year we uh, got an award with the community school for uh, solar panels. In, on, the grant was came from uh, Friends of the Earth, and through the SEAI as well, now expanding that uh, project and that, uh, so they're doubling it in size, and hopefully uh, there will be energy available. As John says, they they open in some PowerPoint, so if you get your electric car, <coughs> you get a free charge up in the school and that there. Um, I'd also like to uh, thank uh, all the people who are speaking this morning. We have three of our local businesses that are involved in the service industry and um, a, uh, outside uh, people who are involved in conciliation and mediation and out there. And of course our special guest Mary Kennedy who is long associated with Knock Line and out there and um, we're very welcome, uh, very happy to have her here this morning. Um, I'd like to start the morning um, by uh, giving out a couple of donations ourselves and out there and I'd like to ask uh, Julie uh, come up and present a check to the Knock Nine Men's Sheds. Uh, I think uh, the Knock Nine Men's Shed is represented by um, I think Carl and Eamon and out there. Carl is the treasurer and Eamon is the chairperson. Julie. <laughs> It's been a great success, and the, the numbers are, are, are tremendous that they have already in that there. And uh, I think we want to say a few words on how it's going. Well, just on the, on the cost side of things, again, we're very appreciative to the Knockline Network for this uh, donation to it. Like, even just in the formation of a, of a, a new organisation like that, insurance alone was nearly a thousand euros just to have the basic level of insurance in place. Um, so, this is a very welcome um, donation to us, and thank you very much indeed. Um, Eamon, our chairman, will give you an idea of some of the, just very quickly, some of the activities that we're undergoing in our membership. Okay, yeah, but we have, uh, we started off with a meeting here, and we had almost 100 people turn up on the very initial meeting, so we started off in, on a sound footing. We have um, meetings every Wednesday, in, and we've been very kindly donated the, the Nakhlein United Clubhouse of Business at no cost to us. So we meet there every Wednesday at 11 o'clock. Uh, we have uh, uh, the activities include we have uh, pitch and push running once a week. We have uh, hill walking. Uh, we've visited, we've arranged visits to the likes of Pierce Museum and that. Um, we've just got again with Napline United. They've given us a, a, a steel container, a portable container, which we propose to uh, convert into a workshop for uh, activities like carpentry, woodwork, and. Other, um, other planned activities like painting, we have um, darts and games and in the, you know, so we have a pretty active thing. So, but we again just to say thanks to the Notre Dame Network for the donation that the students this morning. So thanks very much again. Okay, well